So uh, business strategy is different in Asia. Yeah, I think most definitely. And um, the reason why I say that is you know, Asia is a very different place. The people are different. Okay. The social economic reality is different. The cultural identity is also very different. And all this difference inevitably requires you know, a localized approach towards strategy. And what a lot of businesses, what they don't do well is that they don't actually, they struggle to understand how localization works for strategy. So for example, when McDonald's entered into India you know, way back, for them, they thought they had a business model that was well established. They thought food is universal, everyone loves food. And they thought that what they had to do to localize it was just tweak it culturally a bit, package it a bit differently. So they think it would be sure sell. What they didn't realize until many years later was that it was a substantial mistake because you know, the Indians, the vegetarianism was quite widespread for the average Indian citizen. Not only that, vegetarianism was also very tied to the religious identity. So the backlash was actually quite severe. There were a lot of anti-beef protesters attacking and vandalizing McDonald's, Ronald McDonald statues as well. So they were not really able to consolidate themselves in the market because they didn't actually truly localize. It was not until when they changed you know, the menu and the entire design of the restaurant where they even got rid of some of their best sellers in other places could they really you know, gain a foothold in the market. And I think what that brings to point is the fact that you know, there's no one size fit all strategy, especially in Asia. It really requires a more tailored approach where you understand the market much more and that's the only way to go about it.